Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I just thought I'd share with you my Catagram haul. Um, so this is the Louis Vuitton Cruise 19 collection, um, so which featured quite heavily the Catagram, which of course is a collaboration between Louis Vuitton and Grace Coddington. Um, so it's very fun, it's very cute, it features um, cats quite heavily because Grace Coddington is very much a cat crazy lady. She's so fab, she loves her cats um, and she did the illustrations herself so you could probably tell um, that they almost look a bit more hand-drawn which is really sweet. Um, when this collection was first shown on the runway, that was back in May uh, 2018 and I saw the Panama set, which is what you see here, on the runway in one of the looks and I just thought, okay, this is the bag I'm going to have to stalk down in like six months time. Like I knew it then, I knew it was going to have to be a bit of a struggle, a bit, bit of a mission, um, which of course any good thing worth getting is. Um, and this particular bag did happen to fall in my hands, thankfully. Um, so originally from the runway obviously it was shown together and I thought that they would maybe sold separately but they do indeed come as a set so it comes as twin set two bags one smaller one larger um, and I just loved the colors I loved how it reminded me a bit of the Infra Rouge monogram, which was the black with the red, and it was something that I had missed out on that still haunts me till this very day. Um, so this was sort of like the next foray into something a bit deeper in the monogram. And from my understanding, it was an earlier version of the Louis Vuitton monogram. So it might have been one of the I don't know, I heard that, I don't know if it's true or not, but I just thought that was, it's got that sort of more vintage vibe, the particular print. Um, and it's in sort of a really deep, deep shade of orange, which of course is sort of a nod to Grace Connington and her fabulous, you know, red-orange hair. Um, so basically, I picked this guy up because I had my lovely essay stalk it down. Basically, I had told her from like, May that this is the bag that we're going to have to try and get um, and in fact they weren't able to order it, it wasn't something that they could put through as a pre-order but funnily enough the day after launch one showed up in the store so she called me immediately and of course I had to get it so um, I'll show, I'll include some mod shots but basically you've got the two bags, you've got the adjustable straps um, and then it's just so beautifully illustrated, uh, you know, front and back. So just a few of the little details you've got. Um, so she's got two cats, pumpkin and blanket, so they're featured there at the front. Um, and then you've got Nicola Gasquier's little dog at the back chasing a ball, which is super cute. And here you've got um, both blanket and um, pumpkin playing. Um, and again, Nicola Gasquier's dog at the back with a little bone um, and then the details are really gorgeous because they've really taken you know care to make the inside even really special so you've got that beautiful orange uh, lining with the uh, beautiful little it's a little mice print so you, you get that theme of like cat and mouse coming through even on the inside um, and I find the size, although they're smaller, on the smaller size side, my phone fits so comfortably in this little guy. And then, um, you know, wallets and all sorts of, that you can put sunglasses, anything you really need to carry essentials wise can fit comfortably in there. Um, I have seen people selling, like obviously buying it and then selling the smaller guy or the bigger one, depending on which one they prefer to keep, but I would never do that. They stay as a, you know, package deal. It's something that I love and I love the, the look of it on the body together. I will include mod shots at the end, um, but obviously when I'm wearing them together, I do utilize this little um, strap that it comes with. You get this little um, sort of connector strap. I believe this is something that also comes with like your keep all um, 
luggage and things so you, you get that little guy at the side and it's a really great again nod to classic Louis Vuitton but with a fun twist so I just really loved it I know it's not for everybody but I know there's still some catagram pieces that are hanging around in stores so if you've been thinking about it I think you should just do it because it's so gorgeous and it's really easy to wear I haven't felt like it's too much against things I've put it right up against print and um, like printed tops and things that you would never think to put together but they work so I think that's really gorgeous and I just thought I'd share some of the other little pieces that I snapped up um, so when I saw the little bandos I just thought oh as a bando lover I guess we're just gonna have to do it so you've got there's a bit of color difference between the bag um, and the bandos but they're so, they're so cute and they're so wearable and they're really quite adorable I actually purchased both available colors they came in the orange and then they also did a um, black and white version. this guy here you've got that really more you know classic black and white but with the animals the cats and dogs on there as well so I thought that was a bit of fun and seeing as they were both sort of available to purchase I thought why not um, the other thing that I absolutely um, saw and I just had to have because I, I myself am actually a huge dog lover I love 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 dogs and this little keychain was just too gorgeous to pass up this is of course in the epi leather um, and they actually I think they posted little videos of um, them making these pieces because they make clutches or you know larger dog bags and um, also card holders in that same sort of aesthetic and they're just so gorgeous this is all I think hand painted and then you've got the reverse monogram on the reverse side so I just thought that was so cool and it's essentially a little key holder so you've got that little keychain there but I've actually used this um, on my Pachette Matisse just as a little bag adornment and that's really gorgeous as well so thank you for watching guys um, I hope you enjoyed this little catagram haul um, I wasn't expecting to get all those little extra bits um, between the bandeau and the keychain but I just I loved it too much I had to snap them up when they were there um, so let me know your thoughts on the catagram collection did you guys love it um, and what are you looking forward to in the upcoming collections um, and let me know if you'd like me to do a little bando uh, video because I've I've somehow you know cultivated quite the collection of those guys so would love to know your thoughts um, please like and subscribe and I'll include mod shots of that Panama set at the end. Thank you so much guys.